In the earlier videos, we have seen that using condition formatting, it is easy to highlight cells that meet certain conditions. However, it is little trickier to highlight entire rows in a list that contains multiple columns. In this video, we'll show you how to use a formula to highlight a row in a multi-column list. In this data, I want to highlight all the sales made by Steve. We could use conditional formatting, text that contains Steve and it would highlight the individual cells that contain Steve. To highlight the entire row, we need to take a different approach. First, select the entire data. Then choose New Rule from Conditional Formatting menu. Then select Use a formula to determine which cells to format. The formula needs to test cell values in Sales Rep column which is column B. So we enter equals B1 equals Steve in quotation marks. To make sure we are only using col values in column B, we use a dollar sign to lock the column. As the formula is evaluated in each cell of the list, we want the row to change. Hence, we won't use dollar sign for row. Like all conditional formatting, the formatting is dynamic and will change when cell value is updated with the values matching the rule. So if I change Joe to Steve, the cell, the row gets highlighted. If you don't want to change the rule every time, you can go through a video on highlighting dynamically changed values using conditional formatting.